everybody stays here. So, um, there hasn't really been much happening. Um, I'm not really going to talk about The Masked Singer because for when I was that um, interested in on this, um, turned out not to be who I thought it was. Well, actually, yeah, I'm going to talk about it. You know what I said that, um, what was it? Um, I was hoping it was going to be Nikolai Costawaldo or Will Flynn. I'd be disappointed if it wasn't them, but it was somebody else. But I'd be very disappointed if it did turn out to be um, Morton Harkett, who was the one from my heart. And who did it end up being? Him. And, <laughs> alright, before, I mean, obviously the aha fans were like, oh yeah, I know that, and I know that, and that's who was for that, and all that. But to be honest, it could have been Nikolai, it could have been Jerome. Um, but it was, um, on Saturday's episode, I can't remember, oh no, yeah, I didn't click when I saw it straight away. I thought, oh, he's reading the magazine. He was reading a comic. It kind of gives the whole what the fuck the take on me video feel. And then there was a bit, they showed him on the phone and he was going, okay, 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 um, whatever else. And he's going, uh huh, uh huh. And as soon as I hear that, I was like, that, that's it, that is him from my heart. Because I felt like, <laughs> like, what the fuck did anybody else think that I heard that? So, yeah. So I'm kind of annoyed about that because I was so I, I was more convinced it was Jerome Flynn than Nikolai Costawaldo. Um, well, who is it? <gasps> there isn't really much else. I heard a mention of um. Me- uh, I was going to say Meghan Markle, Miles Murray, same initials. Um, I don't know why I was going to say Ma- Meghan Markle. Yeah. Um, Miles Murray was going to be on um, the BBC News channel talking about the whole thing with the West End and theatres and all that. Um, and it said at 9.45. I put it on at 9.45. Actually, I recorded it because I was watching something else. But it finished by that time anyway. And yeah, 9.45, she wasn't on it. I actually said three people were going to be on it. The, um, the Donna and the Rosie. The Donna and the Rosie, he is Donna. The Tanya and the Rosie. And, um, yeah, so when um got to quarter two, she wasn't on there. Then they got to, like, five two, and then she was on just her. And I was like, well, at least it was just Mars, and it, but it, and it wasn't just one of the other two. Because, like, I was watching it for Mars. And she, yeah, she was on there. I think they were literally on there for two minutes. She was literally on there for two minutes. And then I could hear like the music, and, you know, for the news thing. I was like, don't you interrupt it. And they were like, oh, we're not time. And it's like, sure, in such speak or whatever. And I was thinking, if you come around at um, 9.45, like I said, you would have had a lot longer talk to her. So I was like, I watched that tiny bit of Maz for... I don't know, it was probably literally two or three sentences she said or something like that. Um Yeah. So, um yeah, so I will see you in the next video be next week. Um Yeah, oh and the rugby starting, the Six Nations are starting this weekend. Come on, England, come on Wales. If you're thinking why am I supporting both? I'm if if the other thing you have to tick, English, Irish, Scottish, Welsh, or British, I always say British because I'm half English, half Welsh. Um, yeah. So, good luck England, good luck Wales. Okay, we'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.